we have actually made a sneak uh, visit into Grand Bahama Island and I've got two distinguished guests here that want to send a message to the citizens of Statesboro and Bullock County. Uh, to the left is uh, Pastor Swain. We met. Uh, he is a Georgia Southern graduate. Georgia Southern is well represented in this community, and uh, boy, they really are appreciative of what we're doing here. So, Pastor Swain, tell us a little, tell the community a little bit about what this means to you and uh, how much y'all appreciate it. Well, uh, thank you. First of all, let me say, Brittany, I'm very proud of you, girl. <laughs> and let me say to you, this effort, um, Mr. Price, is one of the things that this community needed um, because we have a lot of hurting families. Many families in this community have lost everything, and uh, what they need now is someone to come around them and, and provide some help to them. They do not have, I mean, they don't have finances to replace their losses, and they look to the government and look to other charitable organizations who would, who would extend their, their helping hand to them. And so what you are doing and what you have done already and about to continue to do, let me say we appreciate it. It will go a long way in getting these people back to living their normal life. And that's what we're interested in doing. And so thank you for the efforts. Um, in our congregation at Grace Bible Fellowship, we have many families um, who have lost um, their household belongings, um, have, have to completely almost remodel, rebuild their houses from the inside out. Uh, they need a lot of help. And so I, I thank you uh, so much for the little help that you can give. Um, you bring it together and we will use it, believe you me, to help the many people in this community who are hurting right now. So thank you again very much for your help. Well, this really has been amazing to see how the communities come together, but it's also uh, uh, amazing that we've had this connection with these uh, 38 families and uh, can assure people who help us and contribute to us is going directly to help you. You really made some great comments about uh, your kids and how it touched you, that they were so concerned about you, and then to hear how our community was stepping up. Well, it certainly, it certainly was a surprise for me um, when I first learned it, of it. Um, but it was a blessing to my heart. In fact, uh, I, I really became emotional, and that's not easy for me. It touched my heart so deeply that the kids being away from us were still thinking about their families back home and were willing to, to do anything they could. And, and of course, God just blessed them with a great idea to solicit the help of the people in Statesboro to help us here. And we want to say thanks again uh, for considering their appeal when we thank them for what they have done for us. We love our kids dearly. Uh, they're special and they're dear to our hearts. And Brittany, you know Papa loved you. Well, thank you so much, Pastor. And you, uh, uh, boy, what a refreshing sight to see a fellow eagle with us. And you were there during the great days. One of the pit first people you asked me about was AP. Yes, and they yes. wanted to know how AP was doing here. And uh, he has a, a large position, and they've been able to connect us with some amazing people in this community already. Uh, but tell us a little bit about what you've experienced and uh, what you want to say to your, your family back in Statesboro. Well, first of all, um, we are truly, truly appreciative of the efforts that the state, my Statesboro family, and I can truly call them family, are doing. I spent um, um, four long years there in that community. And I've gotten to know quite a few people. But um, it's amazing the way the community came together behind our students, um, the Bahamian students that are out there to su support us um, during this um, devastating hurricane that hit us. Um, and so I just want to give a shout out to um, my Eagle family. And we truly, truly love you and appreciate all that you're doing for us. Um, the support is overwhelming. Like uh, Pastor said, it, it, it really uh, touched us deeply um, to see the care and concern. Uh, especially, you know, when you go through a community and you leave, and you think that nobody cares about you. And th this happened and it shows the overwhelming support. So thank you so much, my Eagle family. We love you and, go and pray that God continue to bless you.